Hey, Joey, let's fight them. Hey, why don't you just mind your own business? Get that ass. Blame it on me, okay? Hey, look here, Joey. You may not be scared of him, but I... I'm terrified. I'll... I'll take care of them. Yeah? Well, you'd better. <laughs> <laughs> Master Dad You're the big news Dad, I was up keeping justice You were picking fights You think those were heroic deeds, don't you, son? Listen, you'd better get your act together Master, it wasn't his fault I started the fight well, Joey, you're much older than young Master. You should have more good sense. Oh, Mr. Yin, don't believe my son. I'm sure he started the fight. I know him better than anybody. He was the mastermind. <coughs> uh, Senior Joe. Here we go again. More trouble. Dad. Brother Joe. Forget this. They're just plain youngsters. Trying to act like they're somebody important. Don't get all worked up because of those kids. Please. <laughs> get out. The master was doing me a favor. By not punishing you. Master, forgive me. Oh, listen, kids. Your dad and I are getting old. We'll have to retire sooner or later. There's one thing on my mind, and that's the estate. It has to be managed. And that responsibility is yours, you and Gary's. Understand? You must be united to shoulder the task. That's why we've been strict. We want disciplined men and not spoiled crybabies. Yes, Master. Uh, wonderful. The problem's been resolved. Let's celebrate. There are three new chefs who'll try out their individual specialities. <laughs> Sorry, gentlemen. Just for the evening, you'll have to be the three chefs. Uh, where's the men? We took good care of them. <clears throat> Mr. Yin, will the poison work? You needn't worry. The minute it's taken, it'll melt the whole stomach. Master, all the chefs would like to pay their respects to you. Hello. Um, this is the young master, Senior Joe, Joey Boy. Hmm. Hmm. Master, this is the famous dear stew. Have a taste first. Oh.
Oh. No, you try, Mr. Joe. No, it's poisoned. <laughs>
have entered the Black Paradise. Every 500 years, the gate opens. You chanced into it. You're lucky to see me. Kneel down on your knees. I'm the Black Prince of Hell. State your wishes. I may grant them. Yin staged a rebellion and killed my father. Then he took over Johnson's estate. And now I want to know Gary's whereabouts. He's my friend. Let's find out about Master Gary's fate for you. In no time, you'll join your father in Limbo Land. Traitor, your young master is fearless. Kill me and hurry up. <laughs> right. Let's go. Black Prince of Hell, please save Gary's life. Ever since I lost the battle against God, I swore never to emerge from my black paradise. Don't. You can do it yourself. Why ask me? Me? Do I have the power? Of course, but I must give it to you. I'll do anything to save Gary, to take revenge. Just name it. The Black Prince has limitless power. Will you pledge loyalty? If you serve the prince, you will be me, and I, you. My power will be yours forever. I pledge my loyalty. and your friend. You have sworn your allegiance. You are mine now. Now is the time to pass the nine demons into your body. A drop of blood from you to each of the nine demons and they are your servants. Don't break your oath, or else you will self-destroy. Understand? I understand. are now one. Here's your power plaque, a nine little demon sword. With these, you are their master. They cannot disobey you. Thank you, master. Please save my friend now. He's in danger. Help me get there on time. 
You have the power to do as you wish. You are on your own. jewelry that's wonderful if you got another job don't forget i'm at your service <laughs> <laughs> i'll have plenty of work for you in the future <laughs> 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 You get away! I really don't know. I'm gonna kill you! Butler Yin, do you spare Gary's life? Who's Butler Yin? I messed the in. Oh, oh, Master Yin, M M Master Yin, uh, y you've massacred everyone. Uh, please ha have a heart and spare young Gary's life. If you must kill someone, kill me instead of him. Joey, don't humble yourself. Not to that traitor. Well, maybe there's a trace of kindness in his heart somewhere. Run away. Let me die. I don't want you to beg for my life. <laughs> Do you hear? Don't humble yourself. I'm... Um, uh, I'm a coward. A coward? Then you should die right away. Uh. <sighs> Tiger, you... <laughs> yeah? <laughs> but I thought we were friends, huh? <laughs> you started it. <laughs> Nothing. I'm not up to anything. You know, baddies always end up hacking themselves for the money. Let's get rid of the rest of them. Joey, why not fight our way back home? Not just yet. I have to do something. Something very urgent. I'll tell you what. In ten days' time, meet me at the Flower Brothel. Here, take some of this gold. You'll need the money. But it's not ours. Hey, look at these men here. They won't need it. What's wrong with taking some of it? Now remember, I'll meet you in 10 days, all right?
Come on, come on. Oh, no, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Sire, they're real beauties. Now, what do you think of these young ladies? Not bad. They're our best, you know. <laughs> Mama San, get the hell out of here. <laughs> What's the matter? <laughs> Sire. What happened to my girl? Uh, sire, calm down. Uh, yes. You know the girls here, they see money. <laughs> they don't see faces, do they? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I don't have money. Oh. Hmm? oh. Mm. Huh? 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 <laughs> my dear friend, having some problems? Put it on my tab. No need to make a fuss. Oh, oh thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for your help. More than generous. My name's Tanky. I shall repay you. And your name? <laughs> Just enjoy yourself. The pleasure's mine. Don't worry. Pay me back when you can. Oh. Uh, please, please, please have a seat. <laughs> Uh, Come over here. Now, sir, you just relax. Have a very good evening, won't you? That's right. You look after them. Yes, sir. <laughs> please, enjoy please yourself. Please come over here. We'll come now. over come here on, this let's way, go. sir. Let's go. That's let's right. Go. Oh, yes, that is lucky, isn't it? <laughs> so lucky we've got a nice man. <laughs> and he's handsome, too. Oh, to them. You know the girls. They won't go near him now. Well, we can't chase away a wealthy customer. Hey, there is a girl. Let her go in. She's cost me a lot of money refusing to sleep with men. <laughs> so tonight, she'll pay for it. Mm. Come on. My beauty, tonight is your turn. Huh? Mm -hmm. You'd better be good. <laughs> Come on. Come on. This way. Come on, go. <laughs> Master Joey, you like this new girl. She's pretty, but it's her first night. <laughs> Wonderful. I like new blood. All right, right. Uh, uh, come go on, in. Come, get in. come on. Ah. <laughs> come on, let's go.
take the gold and run. We'll take them by surprise tonight. No one will suspect a thing, but hurry up. Demons demand fresh blood every day. I don't have anyone tonight, but don't be mad at me. I will let you have some of my own blood. <laughs> doing in a place like this. It's weird. Oh. Oh. Oh, where do they all come from? Are you new here? I've never seen you before. <laughs> Alive. 
At least you're alive. You blood-sucking demon. You, you're a demon. Don't be scared of me. Jesus, I'm scared. You're a demon. <laughs> That's all right. He is also our enemy. Good. One more done away with. Joey, it's good to see you. Let's go back together now. Listen, Gary, you go back first. I'll join you later. I have something that I have to deal with. my brother die and Mr. Yin? No one saw it? Everyone died. No witnesses. We can't find out anything. Get out! <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> my great chef from Peking. Recognize me? Joey, you should be dead, but never mind. Ha <laughs> 
serve you. We have cleaned the house up. We've checked all the keys and inventory. It's in the book. Who hired all of them? Frankly, I don't know. Joey! I know you're behind all this. Come out! Come on! Show your face! Master, one other thing. We have announced to the world all about the recovery of your estate. Congratulations, sir. Master Gary. Joey! Master Law and his son. Uncle Law. Cousin, please. I must admit I was shocked when I heard all about the coup. We set out from home to offer help. Then halfway we heard you had recovered the estate, killed the traitor. Now we are quite relieved. I didn't do it alone. Black Wolf people. Oh. It is Black Wolf. That demon. He, he's not man. Not human. All my men massacred. I pretended that I was dead. 
The demon. Is his name Joey? Frankly, my good friend Joey helped me along. Joey? The demon Joey? Joey? He's my closest childhood friend who grew up with me. I don't know anyone called Demon. I have been hearing all about this man called Joey. That he's not human. That he's very brutal. That he kills and steals, never leaves a witness. Although the victims were no saints either. But no one should kill wantonly. Many innocent people fell prey to his hands. Joey doesn't do that. I'm sure that demon Joey isn't the same person. Hmm. I hope so too. If they are the same person, my dear friend, you have to bring him in. We picked him up on our way here. Unfortunately, he has been killed. Oh, he was killed by that demon Joey. Just before he died, he saw Joey coming out from Cousin Gary's house. Did you see him there? I did not see him. You know, this whole thing seems strange. Johnson's estate was taken over by Yin. Then all of a sudden, Gary managed to recover the place. Quite easily, too. But he claimed he had help from Joey. But not Joey the demon. But then you claimed you saw Joey. This time Joey the demon. Coming out from that place. Maybe there's a cover-up somewhere. Joey steals for Gary to rebuild the estate. I'm afraid. I suspect this too. We will visit Gary and confront him with our suspicions. Black Wolf mentioned that this Joey isn't human at all. He likes to suck blood. Hmm. I heard that rumor too. No matter what, I know his Kung Fu is very good, so you must be careful. My dear nephews, I have a thought. Maybe in order for us to get rid of Joey, we should get rid of Gary. I see what you mean. <laughs> Goodbye. Dad, you have motives. What are they exactly? Hmm, you guess. I know you're ambitious. You want to be the best. You're always jealous of Master Johnson and his estate. His was bigger. And now you're plotting again. In fact, how to usurp his estate. Oh, is that what I'm thinking? I must tell you, I don't condone your motives. Also, I think it's wrong to be greedy. You should just let Gary and Joey be. You're here for what purpose? I don't understand. The Foo Brothers congratulate you. But uh, there are rumors that the demon Joey is your close friend. Just a while ago, we saw him coming out from here. I told you already. Joey is really my closest friend. But I'm looking for him. He's not at my place. You must have got the wrong person. And my friend Joey is not a demon. Well, he's normal. Hmm. I don't believe you. If he's around, he'll come and see me. I wouldn't lie to you. I'm telling the truth. Huh. Maybe you two are up to something. What are you talking about? This renovation is very costly. But you have no money. How dare you? This is a private affair. When it comes to murder, it becomes public. <laughs> what we are thinking of is Joey stealing the money and then giving it to you. Brothers, listen, brothers. This is pretty clear. Just ask him where Joey is. I'm sorry, gentlemen. I got nothing more to say. Gary, this is the last time. Tell us where we can find Joey, and we'll leave you alone. Or else you'll be in big trouble. Joey's my best friend. And he's not the one you're after. He's normal. Joey's a good friend. I forbid you to harm him behind my back. You have to fight me first. Brother, he's guilty. <coughs> Gary. Brother, don't you remember Law's hint? Kill Gary. Then we'll have one less enemy.
You needn't be loyal to him. Why lose your life for him? Go away. Your lives will be spared if you go, or else you die. Don't run away, my friends. Defend Gary. <laughs> <laughs> These are all my friends here. I don't want you to touch them. I will give you blood. Lots of blood. Hey, please come inside. Hey, tea, please. flower. How come you're not in the brothel? Hmm. Don't be shy. We've met each other once already. So we're not strangers. Isn't that right? Hmm? <laughs> hey! Follow her and tell me where she lives. That's an order. Yes. Please come in, sir. Uncle Law. Uh, Fuji. Gentlemen. Please. Please. Where are your brothers? Oh, they're on their way. To Black Wolf's estate. First to deliver his body back home. And to keep the peace around his county. Mm. I've decided to go home. To keep an eye on things. Judging from your plans, you must have accomplished something at Gary's place. Let us sit down before we discuss it.
There's no one around now. You can speak. Hmm. We've killed Gary. It was an easy job. No. What? You killed Gary? Hmm. We questioned him about Joey. He denied it. And he challenged us not to interfere. So we took care of him. You killed him just for that? He collaborated with Joey. That's enough. There's no evidence that Joey is a demon. There's no witness that he's a killer. And Gary was innocent. He hadn't done a single thing wrong. This is ridiculous. You killed a man for no reason. Well, you. Your father's also involved. Dad? Fuji. What are you saying? <laughs> Uncle Law. You asked us to kill him. To get rid of him. Hmm. Never. Not me. You hinted to us that to get rid of Joey, we must get rid of Gary. You are making all of this up. Hmm. I never said that. Ah, I see. So I'm lying. You're guilty of lying and plain murder. Hmm. So I'm the scapegoat. One's lying, the other covering up. You want to kill me next? Fuji. Hmm. Listen, man. I'm not afraid of you. I have backup. <laughs> What now? Trying to escape? Hmm. Fuji, you're plain scared. And you feel guilty. That's why you've been accusing girls. I don't want to kill you. It would be too easy. But you have killed Gary. You admit it. Justice will be done. Dad, you're getting extremely vicious. I'm handsomer than all your other customers. I never had a customer. Not when I was at the brothel. I won't now. Because I've left the Mayflower. Ha. Huh. Mia Flower Extraordinary. You're one of a kind. I was sold to the brothel. Thank goodness I met a kind-hearted man who helped me escape. Was this man called Joey? Mm. A lot of weird things happened at the Mayflower brothel. I think that's him. I'm looking for him. Do you know where he is? Uh, ever since that evening, I've been looking for him, wanting to see him. I don't know where he is. I wish I did. Mia Flower. Joey is a dangerous man. He is wanted everywhere. If you know where he is staying, you'd better tell me. I don't believe he's dangerous. Furthermore, I haven't seen him. Hm. I'm afraid you're in love. But you see, you can't harbor a murderer. You'll just get yourself in trouble. I told you already. I don't know where he is. Hmm? I want the truth. I'm telling the truth. I don't know. <coughs> hmm. Mia Flower. I'm warning you. If you don't want your face to be scarred, that pretty face, you'd better start talking. <coughs> uh. Hold it! <laughs> Cousin Roland, how unexpected. Why aren't you running around with father? Mind your own business. Shut your trap. I'm a bit suspicious of your intentions. Well, let's say I don't like you. So what are you doing here now? This is my room. What are you doing, bullying a woman like that? You're just a good for nothing. I was asking about Joey's whereabouts. Joey's okay. You're the killer. That's a fact, and you admitted it. <laughs> Bullying a woman. I saw you do it. My conclusion is you are the baddie. <laughs> I see you've given your verdict, and I am the baddie. Cousin Roland, the judge, has done justice for the world. Well, I don't accept your verdict, nor your pompous attitude. I challenge you to a fight to see who's better than the other. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 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 
Roland, don't try to be smart. Your family and ours are relations, after all. Don't force me to kill you. <laughs> Roland, I can't let you go. I have to take you as a hostage, just to protect ourselves. Lock him in that room. Keep him there. Sire. Come on. Brother, who is this woman? She knows Joey. Lock her in her room, too. And be careful. Yes, sir. Brother, we must have a serious discussion. Come on, move it. Law has openly challenged Joey to a duel at the Wild Sparrow Lake. Brother, Law has turned against us. You're right on that. He sent out leaflets everywhere, announcing that the Full Brothers are guilty of murdering Gary. I knew he'd do that. His intention is to spur Joey to come to us to seek revenge, cunning guy. And also, he wants to isolate us. He wants us to perish. Right now, Gary is gone. So if he gets rid of us and claims credit for killing Joey, Law will be the king of this region. Brother, that sounds sensible. Thank God we have the girl and Roland. That should hold back Joey, and also Uncle Law. We are prepared to face Joey the Demon, and we got a lot of bowmen around. We'll lay an ambush against Joey. If he shows up, the bowmen will take him by surprise. Mm. <laughs> Close. Mia Flower, it's all right. Don't you know who I am? I'm not one of Fu's men. You're Joe. Joe. What do you want this time? Huh. You seem pretty confident that you'll have no trouble overcoming me. Mm-hmm.
So you must be a friend then. Of course. You're dressed like them, but your Kung Fu abilities surpass the Fu brothers. You can't be one of them. Then who do you think I am? You? I'll give you a clue. His father was killed, his friend, and his friend's father were brutally murdered. He is angry, and he's taking revenge. You, you must be... He's Joey. He sneaked in here to take us away. He's a good man. Joey the demon. Mia, I told you I had a bad reputation. I don't care. Mr. Rowland, Joey is a good man. Does he look like a demon to you? <laughs> Not really. He doesn't look like a cutthroat. Joey, he thinks you're okay. Some people understand. Mr. Rowland, he kills because of revenge. He's not a murderer. I understand. You have to complete your revenge. But you don't look like an indiscriminate killer. As the Buddha says, forgiveness is blessing. And lives are special gifts. Gary's life was special, but it was taken away. In that case, the Fu brothers are guilty. Your father, too. My dad. I can't defend his ruthless actions. The Fu brothers killed my friend Gary. When he died, he had six knives in him. He never had a chance to fight back. His followers were not spared. They were killed. They carried out a cold-blooded murder. I cannot spare them at all. You and Mia keep out of this. This is my affair. Stay in the room. Look after Mia. I ask of you. Mia. You stay with him. Don't come out of the room. Understand? We should not meet again. I'm a killer. Not worthy of you. But I'll remember you. Mia Flower, he's a bit extreme, but don't mind him. Mr. Rowland, will he, will he be in danger? His Kung Fu is good. I don't think the Fu's have a chance. But then, they're pretty sneaky. They might have thought of other plans, such as staging an ambush. Started. It sounds like a nasty fight. Indeed. <laughs> Joey the Demon? That's right. It's me. These friends of yours have met their deaths. You're cold blooded, <laughs> cruel, and ruthless. You fit into that description as well. Get on with it. Let's settle our grievance. Winner takes all. Right. Winner takes all. Daggers killed Gary. You're getting off lightly. I'm killing you with two each, but that's too easy. I'll make you die more painfully.
hand. And Joey seems to be getting out of control. I'll go take a look. Mr. Roland, I'll go too. Joey really is the demon. All of them died so awfully. You're not to touch my friend. Go feed off the other men. Get away. Joey, you... You indeed are the demon possessed. When Gary was in danger, after the coup, I wanted to help. But I was powerless. Then I fell into hell, and I met the Prince of Darkness. I implored him to help. He granted my wish. But I had to serve him and follow him. So it's not your fault, but it's enough. You've killed them now. Your mission is now accomplished. Put down your sword. This is black magic. Joey, leave it for the devil. It is too late for me to convert. You see, I took an oath to serve the devil. Mia, that was why I told you not to see me again. I didn't want you to remember me as a demon. I care too much for you. I don't care, I love you. We have power, willpower. When it's strong, it can change realities. Joey, give up the devil and the black magic. You can change if you want. Roland, it is too late now, but thank you. You're a good man. Please take care of my girl. I know you will. I have to go meet your father now. But you're like a friend to me, and he is my blood relative. I don't want either of you killed. Let me come with you. Let me patch things up for you. No way, Roland. Your father has to pay for the crimes he's done. I cannot forgive him. Joey, promise me, don't use the black magic. All right, I promise you. I won't use magic to kill Roland's father. I'll fight him man to man. Goodbye now. I must be on my way. You won't see me again? Well, I'll follow you. Joey, wait a minute. I only promised not to use magic to kill your father. I didn't promise anything else. This is our big chance to kill the demon and to achieve fame. Well, get him out, right? See if he can fight on water. Master, this plan is a sure winner. Joey, don't scare me. Do you use magic on us? Listen, send them away. Joey, come and fight me.
A little magic, and the lake's frozen. Five to one. That's a bit unfair. Now we're even. A young friend who's possessed. Could you exercise him? He's merely possessed, but he's a good man. Please help him out. Oh, 
I promise not to use black magic on you. But you're not playing fair. I don't see why I have to. such a good man continue to serve the Black Prince? Please help him, Master. He's killed a lot of people. But if he repents, all is forgiven. That's what the Buddha says. You're quite right. One repents, all is forgiven. But he has to repent first. He doesn't seem to want to. Then I can't help him with it. He is deeply possessed by the devil. If he can see the truth at any time at all, then he'll have a chance to turn good and discard the demons. But what? Then... You two are very kind. Come here. Oh, man. is a chant. Remember it. It is powerful and very useful. What can I do? When you see him, use your chanting to try to help him. If he has the will to change, the power of your chanting may save his life. Thank you for your guidance. And I got my promise at first, and look what I received. So I have the devil in me. That's why I'm not dead. Without him, I'd collapse immediately. Now both Gary and I have fallen victim to your father. Life's unfair, so what's the difference? Joey, 
You're very right. You have the right to lead your life and to seek revenge for what you think is unfair. But he's my dad after all, and I can't watch him die under your black magic. I hope you understand me, my dear friend. Please forgive me for this. Ha <laughs> 
You had the good sense to turn away from the devil. The demons which possessed you have been destroyed. Your spirit lives, and I shall ask Buddha to reincarnate you.